just a little tip to those who are gardening either in the desert or in tropical areas you know especially during this time that it's already cold season it doesn't require for you to overwater the plants because if you're going to overwater it the roots are going to be suffocated and that is not healthy if the root system are suffocated so that is why during the the cold season the technique that I have been doing here in our garden is that I just overwater it once in a week and then the succeeding days I am watering each or every other day and whenever I am watering it I am watering only like few just like this one just like the moist because during the night it's going to moist also and the moisture is that is what they require at this point in time so for you to be able to save water especially those who are in the desert because there is a scarcity of water and it has been prohibited to even water the plants in here yet we have to find ways we have to think of ways to ensure that we got we have gathered much moisture and for sure this plant is going to gather moisture because of the presence of the leaves and it kept the coldness of of the night and it kept at the base and, and perhaps that's the cause we're in moist is going to be kept and captured and translated into water and that water becomes the nutrients for the plants as it fell to the ground so do not overwater your plants or else it is going to be suffocated and it is not nice that the plants are going to be suffocated they are going to die also die of suffocation just imagine yourself being suffocated so will you not die of course you will die of suffocation and that's the same principle we need to understand in plants they are also like us human beings they also need to breathe and they also need to have gradual consumption of water and not to successively give them water as you wish them to have it's not like that you, you should also be considerate about them because they are also like human beings so this time around you will really be observing that the, the leaves of the rock melon are expanding in its width you can see that before it was just like as small as this and now it is becoming like this i didn't zoom this one but this is the actual size of it and there are plenty of young shoots grown if you could remember there were only like 29 sets that i planted yet right now if we're going to count the young shoot one two three um four five six seven eight nine ten it's already ten i'm only here 10 11 12 you know 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 and 29 so i'm only here in that particular section but i didn't make any rounds the entire section yet there are plenty of young shoots that's how multiple growth is being illustrated here but from a single 
vine it developed into more vines and we're just happy to allow it to be featured and I hope you like the video if you are having the same mind and endeavors please do like and subscribe and share and leave a comment and suggestion down below thank you guys for watching sas tv official